The lag is real. Oh! Oh, what the fuck is this? Sup supplemental damage? Oh, look, it's light. <laughs> totally saw that coming, Pepega. What, Athena? Oh, wait, what? Oh, what? What, Athena as well? What the fuck? Oh, he's a new character. Whoa, he's dark. Oh, Gabriel. Yeah, that's we, we knew Gabriel was going to be in there. But I didn't know uh, Eustace is going to be a new character. And Athena, man, what the fuck? Hey, how's it going boys? What is up? Sora's back once again for another character impression. What is up boys? And as you can see on screen, man, we're going in hot. We're going in hot, baby, for some roasted pork. <laughs> the one that everyone's been waiting for, man. The newest Zodiac character has been released. Her name is Kambira? What? <laughs> Wait, what? English is Snape as Kambira? That sounds really, really wrong. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Kambira? Skubira sounds a lot better. <laughs> Kambira? Come here. Come here? Hmm. Okay. Okay, never mind. She has 10,000 attack. Wow, okay. She's spear and axe. Oh. Spear axe, man. Okay. Okay, okay. I'm alright with that. Alright. She's attack base. She's light. Massive flag damage to her foe. What's the thing called? Gilded Heaven Strike. Restores Kubira's HP. Gain razor back lances. Okay, that's probably probably that new stack that she has or some shit. Bamboo splitter. Light damage to all foes. Hit hit to light defense. Bar force winds effect to caster. What in the shit is that? <laughs> Last for hundred eighty seconds. Deals bonus damage to all foes and gain razor back lances upon attacks. Can't be removed. What? Okay, second skill is Reckless Abandon. Light damage to a foe, boost to all allies multi attack rate. Oh, boost to one foe attack damage. Boost to specs based on the number of casts, max five times. Wait, what? Double attack rate is boosted. Can be removed! Triple attack rate is boosted. Damage and damage cap for one foe attacks and counter attacks are boosted. Wait, counter attacks? What is this? Counter attack fan mana all of a sudden? Okay, so I'm assuming this will be reduced by one turn. Okay. Boost to caster's hostility. Wait, flowering brilliance. Boost to caster hostility. Tank and counter. Oh, okay. We know where this is going now. Oh, I can totally see where this is going. Boost to caster's hostility, tank and counter effect up to 3 hits. Boost to charge bar upon taking damage. Oh. Okay, okay. Half bar will travel, probably like 7 turns. Oh, okay. Okay, so passive. Recklessness. Incarnate. Low charge bar game. Huh, another one. Deals high damage for one foe attacks. Wait, what? High max HP. Deals high damage for one foe attacks. That means her damage. Si she's she's she needs to single attack. <laughs> she needs to single attack to do insane damage. Is that what they're trying to say? Or maybe it's just like the first hit. Maybe it's just like the first hit. And then the, the falling hits just normal attacks. Huh. Queen of Boars. Gain Razorback lances upon one foe attacks and counter attacks. I think one foe attacks is just Ogi, right? Is that just Ogi? Max four levels. So four stacks. Reckless Abandon activates at the end of turn. When. What? When Razorback lands levels at max. Level resets upon activation. Huh. So this activates when Razorback Lance is maxed. 
So how do you get there? Only by Ogi, huh? Wow, okay. Wait, what's one full attacks? Single target? Single attack? This looks really good, but... What's one full attacks? Can someone remind me how that works? <laughs> <laughs> is that single like the first attack regular attack oh okay so that's what they call it okay oh okay so that means wait okay hmm did anyone luck shit her already okay so this yeah so this Allows her to get an Ogi, her autos as well. So she's gonna get max. So it's only four. So she can get that rel relatively fast. Huh. Let's see her weapon. Supplemental damage to MC. Whoa. No cap though. Wait, what? Another stamina? Wait, what? Another stamina? Wait, what? <laughs> Another stamina with Ogi damage? Huh. Is that... Is that gonna get cap? Is that gonna get like a big boost to Ogi damage and small boost to cap? At full lumen break? Huh. Another stamina. Hmm. Okay, very, very interesting weapon, I'm saying. That looks like it has crazy potential. Holy shit. Okay. First things first. She doesn't look trash, unfortunately. <laughs> first things first. It's unfortunate that she doesn't look trash right off the bat. <laughs> she looks... Actually, she looks pretty nice to have. She looks pretty nice to have. Um, It doesn't look like it's really, really hard to gain this razor back. Razor back lances. I almost call it Razor Black for some reason. Hmm. So her stacks only max four times. It's really, really easy to get it. So she can auto nuke every time very, very easily. Wait. Wait, does that mean this cast means you can get these buffs as well? Fucking hell, that's actually pretty insane. Fuck, I didn't think about that. Holy shit, that means. As long you attack three triple you triple attack once, you Ogi once, you already get that. You can just What the fuck? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> what does this also go like? New spark target boys, new spark target. <laughs> Wow, okay. Shit. Oops. Damn, this is really, really good. And this. Low charge bar gain. Okay. High max HP. Hmm. High max HP. Pretty damn good, actually. That's really, really damn good, too. Hmm. Wow. Damn, all the skills synergize to one another. Holy shit. Wow. I'm actually legit surprised. She's gonna be able to- she, you can bring her into shiny too, that's the thing. Because all can't be removed. And then this helps as well for shiny. I mean for light users, that's, that's it. And plus she can heal herself. She can heal herself. She's gonna be core in shiny now because she can tank. I'm quite curious to know what the numbers is, but it's okay. You don't really need to know num numbers. This full blown impressions, man. First impressions. Okay, so first things first. Unfortunately, she's good. She does look like an easy 9.5. <laughs> she does look like an easy 9.5. <laughs> There's no doubt about that. She looks really, really fucking good. <laughs> like, as time... Because the other thing is that she gets a lot stronger because of this. 
And it's not hard to get that too. It's not hard to get 4 stacks, it's not hard. That's just 4 attacks. Unless that means 4 turns. Wait, 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 wait. Is that 4 hits or is it 4 turns? I'm actually assuming that's 4 hits. Because they count based on autos, right? But I'm assuming it might be actually 4 turns instead, right? 4 turns? Yeah, it makes more sense being 4 turns. Because 4 hits is, a, is like too much, too, too fucking broken. 4 turns makes more sense, yeah. But, uh, here's the thing. You get that really, really easily, because you can get it from turn 1. You can get skill 1 and Ogi, so... Yeah, it's it's really, really easy to keep this up permanently, man. It's fucking easy to keep this up permanently. That's why. You know what's the best thing about this? You don't even need to press this button. Do you know that? You don't need to press this button at all. Like, given the circumstances, you don't need to press the third skill at all. You only need to press the first skill. And maybe at times this. When it goes off cooldown. Technically, you don't even need to press this when it's like... I mean, you want to charge up your razor, razor back shit. Then yeah, then you just press this. But besides that, you, don't, you only need to press this when you want tank stuff. Or counter stuff. Huh. Wow, she's really, really strong. Holy shit. <laughs> but let me see. So, in comparison to other characters that has very similar capabilities for light, she's definitely way superior though, that's for sure. You can be a lot faster with her as well. Because this can technically be up all the time. How much does this last? 3 turns, right? So, you can get this, you can cast this again because of this in 3 turns super fast because of this and this. But I'm assuming the low charge bar gain is probably very similar as uh, Shiva, probably 8%, 7% ish. 7 to 8% ish per hit. So I just put her at the back, I guess. It's not really gonna be hard to get it to 70%. No, I don't think so. I think if you use Amira, it wouldn't be great. Does it stack with Amira? I'm pretty sure it does, right? Yeah, because the thing is, uh, charge bar gain is not really going to be a problem for light because number one, you have Amira, if you're using Amira. The other one is the Huanlong Spear. And she's Spear. You see that? She's Spear. And you can get Huanlong Spear that increases your charge bar gain too. See that? See see the synergy already? Hmm. Plus you can even go Akasha Spear for her. Or if you actually think about X, I guess you can if you want, but I don't see why. But my god. She's apparently breaking the servers right now, but holy oh, wow, she's actually really, really good. Damn my prediction is wrong. Yeah! <laughs> she looks really good, man! Holy shit! Why does she look so good? Okay. Let me see what is her... Oops. Let me see what is her second portrait real quick. Because uh, I do not see it yet. Why does that look so lewd? Holy shit. <laughs> Why does that look so lewd? That looks so lewd! What is this? Jesus, man! <laughs> That's a giant tail. And look, it's going, it's going to Gachi. That's the Gachi emote pig right there, man. Look at that. It's going, it's like, oh, Gachi emote. Gachi emote. What the fuck, man? The pig is going full Gachi right there. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking nut, man. Okay. Oh boy. Damn, she, 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 she synergized with uh, like almost every character in the game. <laughs> Just put her in there. You're good. <laughs> Damn, she's really good. <laughs> My prediction is gone. Feels bad, man. She's Why is she so good? Why is she so good on release? God damn it. <laughs> I 
got scammed. Why is she so good? God damn it. Okay. Um, did anyone get her yet, by the way? Because I want to see the EMP. Does anyone have her yet? I'm pretty sure one of you have already luck shit her, right? Come on, hit me up with the, the links for her EMP. Jesus Christ, it's so huge. <laughs> this is Mr. Krupp's version. Holy shit, it's so big. <laughs> okay. Wait, what? What? She has kill cap and Ogi cap? Wait, what? Three crits, Ogi cap and skill cap. What the fuck? That is fucking insane. What? Holy shit. That is some top tier fucking EMP right there. What? <laughs> he really ringed her. Jesus. <laughs> Holy shit. Do you even need the debuff success though? Do you? Nah. Nah, debuff success is not exactly important. Wait. Oh wait, it is actually. Oh, it is actually important. Debuff success rate is actually important for her. She does- this looks important because her first skill re relies on her landing the debuff, so... I think this is important as well. Holy shit! 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. No, I can't max this out, man. You need to put this as well. Alright, can someone hit me up with the, the support EMP? Boost the defend while more force wins is in effect. Oh. Is that to an entire party or a single party? A single member? Is that to the entire party or just boost to... Yeah, is that to the entire party or what? Huh. I don't think it is though, right? Oh, it's the entire party? Oh shit, man. Oh shit. Okay. The lag is real? Yeah, man. Hmm. Damn, it's so hard to choose though, because these, these two is super important. This tree is really important as well. And this though, this is actually important as well. I think I'll just, maybe I'll just put one point in this. Put two points in this. Because I'll definitely max this this five out. Two, three crits will be maxed. This two will be maxed. Two, put two points in this. One point in this. So either that, I'll just put two, one point in this and two points in this. My god. That is some crazy EMP, man. Holy shit. Game crashing, yeah, I noticed. Servers are going bonkers right now because of her. My god, man. She's really good. <laughs> She's really, really good. Holy fuck, man. Holy shit, she's really fucking good, man. My god, she's really fucking good. She's a super easy 9.5 right there, man. Okay, so, uh... Is there anything else to say about this? I don't think there is. She can keep this up permanently. This is great. Tank stuff, she can counter as well. as like, everything is just gonna be... Her weapon is good as well. as like, oh god, what? Okay. Easy 9.5, guys. So, uh, yeah. I don't think there's really much else for me to say about her in terms of, like, just first impressions type. But, yeah. So, anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this wonderful Kambira impression. I'll see you guys in the next video or on stream.